Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Gems of Knowledge. So today we are dealing with the exercise 4.5 of polynomial from class 9th. So before starting the video, make sure to subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell button to get the notification as soon as I post my new videos. So here you can see the 6th question, 5th question, up to 5th question we have already done. Now we are going to the 6th one that is write the following cubes in expanded form. Okay, so here a few more questions have been given, 4 questions. So we'll deal with one by one. So here the first one is 2 x plus 1 whole cube. So this is in the form of x plus y whole cube. We have learned the sixth identity that is x plus y whole cube which is x cube plus y cube plus 3 sorry plus 3 x y into x plus y. Okay. So according to this if we write here for then we can write here this is 2 x plus 1 whole cube which is equal to in place of x we are having 2x and in place of y we are having 1. So here in place of x we need to write 2x and this is whole to the power of cube okay plus y we are having 1 that is 1 to the power of whole cube plus 3 into x value is 2x and y value is 1 okay and again we are having x plus y that is x is 2x plus 1 okay then Next, we can write 2 to the power of 3. Okay, that is 2 into 2 into 2. 2 to the 4, 4 to the 8. We are having again 8 cube, x cube plus 1 cube means it will be 1 into 1 into 1, 1 itself plus 3 to the 6 x we are having and it is again multiplied by 2 x plus 1. Okay, then in the next case, we can write 8 x cube will keep as it is plus 1 we will keep as it is. Again, we need to multiply this 6 to the 12 into x into x is x square plus 6x into 1 it will be again 6x okay so in the proper manner if we write this it will be 8x cube plus 12x square plus 6x plus 1 okay so then the second one is given in the form of subtraction this is 2a minus 3b whole cube again we need to follow the same that is x minus y whole cube which is equals to x cube minus y cube minus 3xy into x minus y this is again the formula okay which we need to use here it was given as addition so we are using x plus y formula here it is subtraction in the middle okay minus sign so we are using x minus y whole cube formula okay then here we can write x to be as 2a minus 3b this is our question which is in the form of whole cube okay now here you can see this x is nothing but 2a and y is 3b so let us substitute in place of x 2a whole cube minus y is 3b whole cube minus 3 into x value is again 2a y value is 3b okay again multiplied by again x value is 2a minus 3b then next same thing 2 to the power of 3 is 8 a to the power of 3 is a cube minus again 3 to the power of 3 so it will be 3 into 3 into 3 3 3 is a 9 9 3 is a 27 you are getting okay so it will be 27 b cube minus 3 2 is a 6 6 3 is a 18 a and b are there will keep as it is okay then this is 2 a minus 3 b okay then you can see 8a cube minus 27b cube minus now we need to multiply this 18 to the 36 a into a will be a square b okay again minus into minus will be plus 18 3 is a 54 we are having a will be as it is and b into b is b square okay then this is in the correct form itself okay so we can keep this as it is this will be the final answer okay then next one you can see the third one that is 3 by 2 x plus 1 whole cube is given so this is also in the form of x plus y whole cube which is equals to x cube plus y cube plus 3 x y into x plus y okay so this can be written as 3 by 2 x plus 1 whole cube which is equals to x cube means again you can see here our x is nothing but 3 by 2 x x is nothing but 3 by 2 x and y is nothing but 1 so in place of x we can write 3 by 2 x whole cube plus y is 1 1 cube plus 3 into again 3 by 2 x 
y is 1 and again x value is 3 by 2 x plus 1. Then you can see here 3 cube is given that is 3 3 is a 9, 9 3 is a 27 x cube okay because x is also multiplied here cube with the cube as you can see okay then divided by this is 2 cube that is 8 plus 1 cube is nothing but 1 itself plus 3 3 is a 9 x divided by 2 when it is multiplied by 1 it will be same again this is multiplied by as it is okay then in the next case we are getting 27 x cube by 8 plus 1 plus 9 3 is a 27 x square by 4 okay x into x we are getting x square 9 3 is a 27 2 2 is a 4 we got plus again when this whole term is multiplied by this we are getting 9 x by 2 okay then you can keep this as it is or you can rearrange this that is rearrangement will be like this let me write here itself 27 by 8 x cube plus 27 by x square by 4 plus 9x by 2 plus 1 this is the rearrangement what we can do it okay then the next one last that is x minus uh, 2 by 3y whole cube this is in the form of x minus y whole cube which is equals to x cube minus y cube minus 3xy into x minus y okay so let us write here that is x minus 2 by 3y whole cube which is equals to in place of x we are having x itself. So we will keep x cube as it is minus in place of y we are having 2 by 3y and this will be whole cubed. Okay because y we are having 2 by 3y and this cube is this one. Then minus 3 into again 2 by 3y again y sorry sorry this is y form and this is x x we are having x itself. So if we interchange here it is no problem because because this is multiplication if it was addition then it was wrong okay just i have interchanged here that is in place of x uh, by mistakenly i have written in place of x y value and this y value is here this x value is here okay then again we need to write this that is x x is x itself and y value is 2 by 3 y then we need to open this that is x cube minus 2 cube is given that is 8 2 into 2 into 2 that is 8 y cube because y is multiplied here 3 times then it is y cube divided by 3 cube is given 3 3 is a 9 9 3 is a 27 we are having minus 3 2 is a 6 y and x divided by this 3 as it is we'll keep it as it is or if you want you can cancel it directly okay here i am going to cancel 3 1 is a 3 2 is a okay then here we are having x minus 2 by 3 y okay then here what we are going to get is x cube minus 8y cube divided by 27 minus 2xy we are having okay 2yx into x minus 2 by 3y now x cube minus 8y cube divided by 27 minus 2 x into x we are getting x square y will be as it is again minus into minus will be plus 2 to the 4 by 3 x will be as it is again y into y we are having y square okay so now we can keep this as it is this is only the proper form here we can keep this as it is so that's all for today i hope this video is clear to you if you're having any doubts regarding this you can comment me down below i'll continue this in the next video so till then stay tuned and stay connected thank you